Hey y'all, it's Elizabeth. Another week down, a beautiful week ahead of us. Are you ready? All right, let's go. Um, a question. Hey Elizabeth, Wah. I do so many crunches and sit-ups, but I still have my belly. Can I get a flat stomach? It's from Texas, and many, many, many people have asked this question. And um, yes, you can. You can have a flat stomach. A lot of people do the sit-ups and crunches, and that's great for the muscle, but we need to get rid of the layer of um, extra, shall I say, on top of that muscle. So here's three steps that you can start doing today, all right? The first one I want you to do is change your eating habits. Surprise! That's the number one thing you can do to get that flat stomach. What I would like for you to do is to have a carb and a protein at every meal. Go out, of course, portion control as well. So go out and buy a lunch size plate. On that lunch size plate, make sure you have uh, meat, your protein, about the size of your palm, and I would say your carbohydrates about the size of your fist, okay? So you want to have your protein and your carbs. That's all you need. Yeah, carbs. Not white breads or bagels or things of that nature. Not the flour enriched, white flour enriched carbohydrates. You want the vegetables, the nuts, the grain carbs, you know. What happens is it is a combination of that protein carb get that stomach nice and full and satisfied. Also, you want to make sure you have your eight glasses of water. Remember we talked about no soda? All right, so our carb protein, every meal with our water, we want that lunch size plate and your golden. So that's step number one. You can start that today, right? Number two is to do your cardio. Cardio, yes. You need to have at least three days a week doing 60 minutes of cardio. On the other days, do at least 30 minutes. And you can do whatever you like, jogging, swimming, dancing. You choose your life, right? So what fits into your lifestyle is what you should do because you want it to become a habit. So three days a week, you're going to do at least 60 minutes. That's an hour of cardio. And then the other uh, days, at least 30 minutes of cardio, all right? So the third thing, stay consistent. Easy, right? So you gotta do number one and number two over and over again till you get the desired results that you want. So what's number one? Get your eating habits under control. Have a protein carb at every meal. Make sure it's a portion control, right? So for breakfast, an example would be oatmeal, and eggs, protein, carb. For lunch, you can have a nice piece of salmon and asparagus. Dinner, a piece of chicken and broccoli sprouts or um, anything, protein, carb, you got it. Then secondly, the second thing you're gonna do is get that cardio, jogging, biking, swimming, dancing, your choice. Three nights a week, 60 minutes, the other two nights, at least 30 minutes. You got this. And number three is to stay consistent. That is so important. Stay focused, stay consistent, and you will see those results. Um, our thought for the week is all that we are is a result of what we have thought. Buddha, right? So we are what we think. You got this. Make this week the best week ever. See you next time. Miss fit1 at gmail.com m-s-f-i-t-o-n-e at gmail.com make it a great week bye-bye